The seventh meeting ever between Alabama and Houston. In the books at Coleman Coliseum as Bama is a winner today, 88 to 66. Hi everybody, I'm Eli Gold. Coach Rick Moody is alongside. An interesting game that started off very tight and well played. Then as the afternoon, early evening came upon us, Coach, Alabama pulled away. Well, Alabama finally decided they're not gonna let us stand out and shoot spot up threes. Therefore, Alabama did what they had to do. They beat Houston at their own game by playing north and south, getting the ball inside to Jasmine Walker or Raya Copeland, uh, Copeland, and then getting the ball off the bounce to the basket. I mean, Alabama played a heck of a game and earned a great, great win. Why don't we take a look at the highlights because we really did see some outstanding play today. Well, Brittany Anyaje, I mean, she's a deep, deep shooter. She's an exciting player to watch, as you can see right there, about four steps behind the three-point line, and then she's going to continue to shoot the basketball, and uh, she's going to be a great player this year for the Houston Cougars. But look at Jordan Lewis. That's the only three she made today, and she had 20 points, or I can't remember the exact total, but look, she's getting to the rim, playing north and south. She refused to settle for the three-point shot, going to the hole, even drawing contact, and a great day at the free throw line, nine for nine. But Jasmine look at Jasmine Walker. Walker, yeah. I mean, just opening the game, jumping in the passing lane, anticipating the pass, getting Alabama on the board early, but then the high-low takes, takes place. Araya Copeland to Jasmine Walker. Then, Jasmine gets it at the high post, one bounce, playing at the rim. Uh-oh, at the very end, she hits a couple more threes. A fantastic day, as you said. Her career high for Indeed, Jasmine Walker. Indeed, a career high, 25 points for her. Alabama will be now 2-0 on the year. Houston drops to one up and one down. Bama plays South Carolina Upstate Wednesday. Hope you can join us for that game.